Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Victoria 2 with the New Nations mod as the Tugular Empire. In the last episode we just took this one little region from Wolof here. They're not quite in France's sphere, they're friendly with France. So we took the opportunity of France being involved in uh, some war somewhere, which they're here, to take a province from them under the assumption that France wouldn't intervene and they didn't. So. That's good. We are now waiting to attack Futaturo, I believe. We are at tru we have a truce with them for another year and a half, I think. So we'll be waiting for that to expire, and then we'll try to go to war with them. They are neutral to all the great powers, so no chance of them intervening there. Although actually, they're allied with Gabu. Gabu is in the UK sphere. Not sure if that allows the UK to eventually intervene in that, if they were to call in Gabu. Let's hope it doesn't. So these two provinces, of course, are the two that we need to form the Mali Empire. Our new first minister is an expert diplomat. Excellent, so he's going to give us infamy reduction and extra diplo points. All of which we would like. Uh, speaking of Diplo points, we need to be... Uh, what am I looking for here? We need to be either allied or we need to conquer Watara and Mossi. So we should start at least trying to ally them. I'd rather not spend infamy on conquering them if I don't have to. Watara extremely unhappy with us because we were previously at war with them. I assume that's why. But we should start spending some points on increasing our relations there so we can hopefully get alliances. Mossy currently a little bit negative. They don't like our infamy, but that will be going down. And too many alliances. We'll increase our relations and see where that gets us. So we're waiting for... I forgot when it was already. It's May 1856. Okay. A bit over a year. I think it's probably better to focus on just one of these at a time. So we'll go for Mossy first. Alliance offer from Dahomey. That's you. I don't think we're interested in that. We are getting more diplomatic points per month than we would usually be getting, but still pretty slow. Our budget is looking pretty good, though. We can probably look at increasing some of our sliders here. Go to 65 on education. Try 55 on military. We can build more brigades, that would be good. What do we need? We'll probably just build one of each. Nope, I think we're still not interested there. Minus 12 right now. Ottomans and Russia are at peace, okay. Oh yo, they're down here as well, aren't they? Nope, I don't think we want to do that either. So with our infamy going down faster, that might get us to the point where we can form an alliance with them pretty soon without us having to spend more Diplo points. 
they're at only minus three. Oh, they're just gone to minus four. Though, building these extra brigades will actually help too. They like our army strength. Maybe not. Maybe plus 10 is the max bonus there. Unfortunately, it costs us two Diplo points to increase relations. An invitation arrives. A group of Western expatriates currently residing in Segu have offered an invitation to high-ranking members of the Tugular government to attend a fancy affair in the legation quarter. We're well aware that this is just an excuse for these men to gain more influence in Tugular Empire. But there could be benefits for us as well, namely the opportunity to gain insight into their methods. Okay, we can lose research points and prestige, or we can gain 100 research points. France gets some sort of event. I think we'll gain the research points. Currently at about 4,000. Probably be getting education reform, I think. Yeah. Probably a good idea. Okay, we will fight the disease with every available resource. Okay, I think we'll just have to increase relations here again. Ambassador killed. Wandering the streets of Segu can be a dangerous thing, as a foreign ambassador in the legation quarter recently found out. Guards report having found him dead at 4am in the morning, apparently the victim of a robbery. However, the foreigners accuse us of having failed in our supposed responsibility to protect their diplomats. We fear that even a formal, ap formal apology will not be enough to placate them. However, something more ta tangible might. So we can get Memorial to Foreign Diplomat for the rest of the game, giving us a constant reduction in prestige and increase in militancy and make our pops in our capital become more reactionary. Or annoy France and lose prestige. Or annoy Belgium even more and lose slightly less prestige. Well, I definitely don't think we want to annoy France. That would be bad, since we border them, I think. Or will border them soon if we don't. Uh, Belgium seem like they would be less dangerous to annoy, and also we lose less prestige this way, so let's do that. Uh, yes, we don't actually border France, though once we conquer these guys we will. We just have these two little areas in here. We do not want an alliance with Oyo. So they still will not accept an alliance. Even if we had the points to offer to them right now. Oh, they actually will accept. Okay, let's do it. Great. So, looking at our decision here, leaves us only three conditions left to fulfill. One of which we can get started on in a couple of months here. So let's make sure they are still neutral with everybody. Budget still looking pretty good. We can probably increase some more sliders. Just a little bit. So it's going to be a bit of a longer process to get Watara to form an alliance with us. They definitely will not accept until we have their relations at least above zero. Which is going to take a while, even with our 
expert diplomat. First Minister was assassinated. Well, so much for our expert diplomat. We're going to get national confusion for a year, lowering our research points, prestige, and increasing militancy and consciousness. Okay. Well, our truce is now over with Futaturo, so let's go ahead and start justifying our Sahel Jihad there. wonder if it might not be actually in our interests to increase relations with France, just to make sure that they can't attack us in preparation for us having a border with them. Okay, cost us 8.5 infamy. Not great. And the crisis did not enlist international interest at this time. So we don't actually have the points because we are gaining them so slowly. But our justification is pretty much done. We should be able to declare war immediately, which we will. So they can call in Gabu, and Gabu is in the UK sphere, which I still don't know for sure whether that means we can, or they, that they can intervene, but we'll have to hope not. They're not in any other wars at the moment. Well, let's just go for it. Don't think we need to call our allies. If the UK comes in, it won't make a difference anyway. They might not even call in Gabu. Gabu might not even accept if they do. And it looks like one of those two things is indeed the case, because they are not in the war. So obviously this will be very quick and easy. They are offering us Acquire Turo Senegal. We will accept, since that is what we wanted. And it brings us one step closer to being able to take this decision. Oh, and we apparently no longer have an alliance with Mossy. I guess they broke it while we were at war. They now will not accept an alliance. Okay, well, our new first minister is a visionary thinker, giving us extra research points. Pity we couldn't get him just before we completed that conquest. So we would have got extra research points from it, but we're up to almost 7,000. And I think I would like to increase relations with France, just to get it above 100. So they can't start justifying any wars against us. I suppose we should probably do the same with the UK, though. Seems less likely to actually happen. In the near future. We are over 2% clergymen. So we'll move our focus to the next most populous state. Continue doing that. And our truce with Wolof will be over in 1859. So we'll have to wait for that to happen. Preferably wait for France to be involved in another, in another major war. Preferably on the losing side and then declare war again for that. Still not accepting an alliance with us. I 
Actually, it would be nice if France were to try and sphere us. Give us some protection. Actually up to cordial with France, so maybe they are even trying to do that. Not actively influencing right now, though. They will accept an alliance back. Let's proceed and do that. Okay. So we'll have to keep them allied with us, and... I think it's looking like we might have to just conquer Watara. Unfortunately, we can't do a full conquest on them. We can't use our... Sahel Jihad CB, I guess. We'll have to do Acquire State, which will only allow us to take this one province here, I think, and then we'll have to do a second Conquest War, which is pretty bad because this will cost us 11 and the full Conquest will cost us 22. We're only getting three provinces out of it, not even the full, uh, not even these full regions. So it's a lot of infamy, unless we get extremely lucky with it, of course. European military mission, one of the great powers of the West, has taken an interest in our country and has offered to establish a military mission. While this might be beneficial to our research, it might also prove a liability in the event of war. However, turning down such a generous offer might be perceived as somewhat of an insult. Do we wish to allow the establishment of a military mission? We can gain some free research points and a research points modifier. And also we'll get relations with the Netherlands, or we can annoy Sweden. I think we'll take the extra research points. I don't think we... well, actually, we're pretty high on militancy. Maybe it's better not to increase that. I think we can afford to annoy Sweden. Okay. I would like the research points. But I think we'll increase relations with France just once get us over 100. Still not trying to influence us. Our first minister was assassinated again, okay. Giving us all of the bad effects for a year until we will get a new first minister. Uh, a new first minister. be November 1859, two years or so. That's fine, we could look for something else to do in the meantime. We got a Lord Admiral, which is not terribly useful to us. That's okay though. I suppose we could look at maybe attacking Sokoto, though for 11 infamy taking one of their provinces may or may not be worth it. Allied with Mossy, who we'd prefer to be on good terms with. Uh, also, they're friendly with the US, which means they are probably off-limits for conquest. Unfortunately. Uh, European military mission again. Increase relations with Prussia. Or annoy Hanover. I think we'll annoy Hanover. So I suppose uh, we'll just have to take this province from Watara. I just think it's going to take far too long to increase relations with them. At the rate we are gaining Diplo points. Aristocrats angered, the reforms sweeping through our country have upset the landed elites in one of our cities. Okay. Of course, we don't even have the Diplo points to start justifying a war with them. 
They're allied with Gabu as well, okay. Uh, so, I guess we'll probably do that. Mm, I'm not sure. Well, anyway, we'll uh, think about it in the next episode, because we're just about out of time for this one. So, thanks for watching, and join me again for that.